Hello, my name's Steve Barnes, the uh, Director in Charge of Property Insurance at Total Landlord Insurance, and today we're going to be talking about fire protection. 4.2% of fire claims over the last five years have been in relation to fire. The average fire claim has been more than £22,000. The number of fire claims over between 2020 and 2021 increased by 70%. We don't know whether lockdown was a factor with more people spending uh, time at home, more electrical appliances being used, and then obviously you've got the winter months and leading up to Christmas where people have things like Christmas trees and lights uh, and more electricity is being used. Make sure your tenants know what to do to prevent fire and the event of a fire, talk them through what they need to do. This should be done at check-in and include a fire safety sheet in the property information pack. Look at things like smoke alarms, the main escape route, not over electrical sockets as I've said, especially around the Christmas period. With more than a quarter of the fire related deaths being due to smoking, banning smoking inside a property is a good idea and should be included in your short short hold tenancy agreement. Also remind tenants that candles should always be put in a suitable holder and then the obvious things like never near curtains or other material that may catch fire and make sure you extinguish the candles properly. Make sure smoke and carbon monoxide alarms are working at the start of each tenancy and encourage tenants to check them on a monthly basis. Smoke alarms ultimately save lives and landlords who do not comply with the latest requirements, especially with the stricter rules coming in October 22, are at the risk of a fine of up to £5,000. Electrical fire has been the main cause of claims in four out of the last five years at Total Landlord Insurance and Forty Electrics calls around 4,000 fire claims across the UK each year. So it's important to make sure the electrical system and any electrical appliances supplied to tenants are safe throughout the tenancy. By law, landlords need to carry out a full electrical safety inspection and test every five years. It's a good idea to have a PAT test carried out every year, at the very least every two years. Fire extinguishers from fire blankets are not legally required unless you are letting a HMO, but it's good practice to provide them, at least in the kitchen. A water mist fire extinguisher costs around £50 and a fire blanket around £15. If you do have fire extinguishers, make sure you check them annually. Again, fire doors are only legally required in housing or multiple occupation, but it is worth installing them in rooms at higher risk of fire breaking out, such as your kitchens. But also bear in mind that if you've got them on all rooms and doors are kept shut, the risk of fire, smoke affecting the whole property are greatly reduced. For more guidance on reducing the risk of fire, please visit totallandlordinsurance.co.uk and remember to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Simply search for Total Landlord Insurance.